the last question is one that we have been getting over the course of the second half of the semester. It's one I've answered in lecture and in previous videos, but I want to take an opportunity now towards the end of the semester to reiterate the fact that the final exam is a cumulative exam and that um, while the focus is on some of the topics uh, in the second half of the course from week six and onwards, um, as I've said in lecture, the material in the first part of the class is really foundational towards trying to look at the puzzles and challenges in the second half of the course. So for the, for the final exam and for your studying for it, I would encourage you to at least review your notes and some of the main points from the first uh, introduction through chapter five in the book, as well as the lecture slides to uh, remind yourself of the, of the theoretical framework that the class and the book has taken in trying to understand international relations and then how you can apply that framework towards specific issues, whether it's civil war, uh, terrorism, um, international political economy, um, development, uh, human rights, international law, and the environment, whatever, that it, the focus might be on, on how we try to understand how actors behave and institutions have evolved related to those specific, uh, organiz um, those specific topics. The idea is, is that it is um, based on that foundation that we laid in the first half of the class. So in your reviews, definitely pay attention to week six through week 12 and try to think about how you would answer essay topics on those specific areas but those essays and those approaches taken in the book, in the lecture, and in your essays should be based on that framework that was laid in the first five weeks of the class. So cover it all, but focus um, by and large on the second half of the class.